and I are definitely um, coming closer to God through not just the race, but through our relationship. And, <clears throat> excuse me, and we feel like Brendan and I are married and we have a, we're a family. And so faith is really important to us. And our religion is really important to us. And we're building ourselves together, but we're also building ourselves closer to become closer with God. And so I think that that's something that we're doing before each leg. Yes, we can't do this without your help. And God, we please ask for your favor in this leg moving forward in the race. We want to be here so bad. It's the desire of our hearts, the strongest will that Brendan and I have right now. Please help us to do well, and please help us to travel safe with everyone in the race. Here we pray, amen. Oh, God, oh, please help us stay focused and not fight and support one another and know that we can communicate perfectly when we're listening to one another. And please just know that we are fighting as hard as we can to be in this race, and we want to be at the end, and we want to win a million dollars. Because we know we'll do good things, and we know that you will help guide us to do good things with that money. We pray this in your name. Amen. Amen. Well, for me, I'm a scientist. So, you know, I, just believing in God and having a relationship with God is something I've always kind of struggled with. Ever since I became empirical and need evidence and question everything and, you know, poke and prod. So when Rachel and I got married, it was something, a covenant we made before God. And for me... When I met her, it was really was kind of the start of my faith because I couldn't just believe that it was random that I would meet this girl, I would fall in love with her. So I think for me that was evidence enough for me that there is a God. So <laughs> I think that that's when I started actually believing and wanting to have faith in God and, and really make it a part of our relationship and this race because... We are very blessed, and a lot of times, sometimes we forget that. You know, we get caught up in our daily lives. We everything so fast. You know, everything becomes a little dehumanized because we just need, we want. You know, but we forget that the rest of the world doesn't always run like we do. So sometimes it's nice to come in these places, these cultures, and stop and appreciate what you don't have and what you take for granted.